So once upon a time, Swag came out and he said that I don't even know what a radar hack is. But see, somebody else was there. They heard him say that and they quickly done their research and they quickly learned about what a radar hack is. <laughs> And ever since that, man, it has been cheating galore. Ever since that, our games have been infested with cheaters. <laughs> like this video if you just want to play games, man. Just like the video if you love getting killed by cheaters. I want to know where you guys are at. And the video that we have today, I, I think you're really not gonna like this one. I right, roll this. Your vision cheats are nothing new. They have been around since 2018. And they were very active during Caldera. Uh -oh. They were ready available if you knew where to look. And more importantly, they were sold for console. Streamers would use these cheats to drop high kill games on console, trying to prove they don't cheat on PC. No! Console cheats as well? He says, was I hacking on console? The answer is yes, you were, bro. Yes, you were. According to him, YouTube, zero people today's cheat. video, we got a special one because I hopped on console to prove some haters wrong. Like this guy. Up on PS5, little noob, let's see them hands won't even drop 20 a game. I'll drop 50 for you. Make sure to like and subscribe. Finish the job. 50 bomb on cards, yo! What are they gonna say? However, when they go to land, they always perform horrible. Oh no. Two Console kills. cheats are very affordable and massively upgraded. They are now a serious threat to online games in general. But oh, more importantly, over. They are rampant in Call of Duty. Black Ops. It's over. It's over. It's like I I don't I I don't watch Call of Shame for like a week and then there's like another cheat pop. <laughs> what the hell, bro? Like what? What is going on in gaming, bro? I just missed one week of watching your videos and now I'm learning that there are like console cheats. Of course, I knew that there were console cheats and there have been console cheats, but they are not too rampant right like when is when was the last time you heard of a uh, of somebody cheating on consoles especially when you had your crossplay off right or yeah right like i never i never even heard of somebody cheating on consoles. <laughs> you know what i mean right i never i never Bruh. heard uh if you go back on the older call of duty games then yeah sure you're gonna encounter cheaters we all have but on the newer newer ones uh, i don't run into cheaters especially on consoles with crossplay off but rip six is set for release soon and the computer vision cheats are all ready for PlayStation 5 and also Xbox. They're Solar. completely undetectable. That's what happens when a company would spend their money on streamers and spend millions on an in-house anti-cheat like Ricochet that ignores cheating streamers that have been placed on a whitelist. Rather than investing in a third-party anti-cheat, such as Badala, cheating in Call of Duty is bigger than ever before when Activision keep dangling hundreds of thousands of dollars in front of cheating streamers. Of course, they're going to cheat for a living. You could be playing yeah, on console like... and you would never know the other person is cheating. Cheating streamers will be using this new technology now, as it cannot right. be detected. Right. This is why you I sure? went to great lengths to bring awareness how... You, you sure that multi-billion dollar company that made uh, that Ricochet cannot detect this one? Who would have thought? Bad DS4 Windows is. It's over. And to ban DS4 and Cronus Zen and any kind of software like that. I don't understand how it's so hard to ban Cronus. I did it myself when I released Guardian Defender. Uh, yo, uh, didn't they come out with an update? Uh, yeah, they came out with an update. They did say a while ago that, uh, that Cronus is no longer gonna be compatible or you cannot use it with PlayStation, right? Because you can get banned now, apparently. They, yeah, right? That happened! But then I remember Cronus came out and they dropped a patch. Bruh. They drop a patch and it was working, but you have to go through like different loops. And then I heard that that also got nerfed uh, in a way where, where you know PlayStation kind of banned it. Or uh, I guess uh, they found these like, I guess found another loophole, man. I don't know. Ricochet only detect the data cable, and you don't even need that plugged in to play the game. It's pointless detecting it. It's a waste of time. The cheating is real, and this is actual console gameplay. These cheats are very cheap and extremely effective, and already making players a good living that compete in the wager scene. Enjoy Black Ops 6. I have always uh, supported Call Nah, bro, you didn't have to like say enjoy Black Ops after that. Call of Duty. I even created video tutorials from my old frag spots. This video is now unlisted. I always sent out hundreds okay. of beta codes early and asked nothing in return. 
I did this wow. to help promote the title. Wow. But that stops now. Once again, the game has been built around the streamers, not the community. I will not be accepting any beta codes this year, and I will not be purchasing this title. She, her, them and him have injected way too much political nonsense into this game now, and I will play no part of it. The movement ah. is hit. Hey man, listen, I hear you, brother. I hear you. I, 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 yeah, bro. Like we, how many times we gotta actually go through that, right? They're turning female chins uh, stronger than. Yeah, I recently just made a video on the, the the fact there's like chin warfare happening in gaming right now. They went ultra woke, and, and of course this is a man. This is Brock Lesnar, right? But like females are looking like this now in video games as well. Yeah, they're turning females looking like this. Crazy, crazy. Idiot. What are we to make of this? This is not how Call of Duty was supposed to be played. The streamers yeah. are obsessed with movement because they lack map awareness. The low IQ streamers have already started to hype the game up. If you want my advice, find an older title and start enjoying it. Welcome to the downfall of Call of Duty. This will get old, fast. And when everyone comes to understand this, and you want to blame... It is over. Now I want to show you this, okay? Check. Team have been caught cheating. Wait, what? what the hell? Call of Shame News. Joe's team have been caught cheating. They have been caught using banned weapons during the World Series of Wallzone. <laughs> the rules are clear. Some grenades are not to be used. They have been deducted points and had their game null. And rightfully okay. so. But Joe is furious. But they are now blaming Activision for making the rules and demanding the grenades are removed in case the Warzone pandemic streamers throw them by mistake. That is a skill issue. Hilarious. The streamers you know, imagine competing in a tournament and then you say okay now remove that rule <laughs> cuz I'm competing in it what the <laughs> bro okay you cannot make this up there are rules set in place and then you go ahead and compete in it you don't follow the rules and then you say okay the the rule that I was not following just remove it from the list okay makes sense like the video guys like and subscribe brothers like and subscribe subscribe everybody subscribe man subscribe agreed bro. with Joe and are attacking Activision for making a rule for their own tournament the streamers Crazy. you see defending Joe either didn't qualify or lack everything should be allowed in terms of gulag easy solution and their problem and they clearly can't take it out so why punish teams for that wait what the skill to even enter the world series i mean you can have your opinion though for sure you can you can have your opinion uh but i guess uh, the reason a lot of people are like hey ho, what 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 is because like these uh some of these suckers are known cheaters i'm not sure about bobby pop i don't think he's a cheater could be wrong i, I don't know much about him other than this clip that went viral when he yeah, did that you remember this He said 18 inch. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know. That's what he said. Suck my 18 inch. More than likely they have been previously banned. They just don't know what rules are. Tim the Tadman's team called out a suspected cheater for shooting through smoke. This resulted in many streamers and simps jumping on board. Oh, that's Yet, dog. The streamers yeah. are silent. Yeah, apparently in the the dock and Tim lobby, they they caught somebody cheating. Uh, just wanna make it clear, like it was not dock, right? Because some people think it, it, it was dog that was cheating. Nah, he was spectating, I believe, a cheater. Somebody was caught. Uh, they caught somebody cheating in their own lobby. Apparently. When Joe was caught doing the same thing only a few days ago. One These thing is moving faster than the UFOs, bro. Not even the UFOs can lock onto humans like that fast. And guys, uh, right as we get down to the climax, wait for the next clip that's coming up. I want to say I have a second channel. This is where we upload UFO content and conspiracy content every single day. Definitely check it out. Links are always in description. And uh, right, let's get back to the content now, boo, boo One of the CODcasters from the official Call of Duty watch party was caught spreading false information. He attempted to cancel Love a streamer it. by providing bad evidence that Chef was using aimbot. He was then he was humiliated not. as someone informed him that he was live ping. New team? He was pinged, okay. Look, right there. 
Oh, that is a life man. hit. You clowns need to stop hacker hunting when you make mistakes like this. That is not aimbot, that is a live pen. I was recently sent a clip that it appears Huskers snaps onto an enemy with aimbot. There is no way. A and you're saying he was a codcaster? So how do you not know? Right? I personally have not played Warzone in the longest amount of time, okay? But like, if you're a codcaster, how do you not know? Bro, bro, please, please. So, we took out time to break this down and unfortunately, we found no evidence of aimbot. Let me explain. First of all, listen to the voice as it states there are four enemies left. Only four left. I've pointed to the arrows, with the fifth arrow being Huskers himself. So the okay. top right that displays five matches up correctly. The four uh -huh. red arrows match up with the enemies left on the compass. Yeah. Not only that, the mini-map also shows there are four enemies. Huskers is not looking at an enemy. Just look at the compass. It's obvious. Mm. Call of Shame is not here to frame streamers. I just want to make the gaming fair for everyone. Make no mistake. Huskers uses mouse scripts and macros to benefit from aim assist on mouse and key. As well as anti-recoil scripts. But this clip is not it. Consider this claim debunked completely. Oh god. Moving oh. on. Okay. Oh man. Oh wow. Is in my opinion. Okay, moving on, and as we moved on, we found out that the homie got blocked. That's crazy, bro. The most corrupt organization in esports. You have to omit, is in my opinion, the most corrupt organization in esports. Okay. You have to ask questions when even their CEO is permanently banned. Can you remember recently <laughs> when I exposed their no! star player for potentially walling in the World Series of Wallzone? I asked the questions and demanded answers. What kind of Imagine you're a CEO of an organization and you got you got banned. I'm assuming because of cheating. <laughs> it, it's over. <laughs> it is over, man. It is over. What are we doing here, man? Imagine being a CEO of your company and being banned. Then what do you expect of the members? Uh, what what else can you expect from the members, bro? I uh, I know we should not label every member like that, but but yeah, no, I, I yeah, I see you, I see you. From little brothers to DS4 aimbots, wait, what? A person tries to bribe someone ten thousand dollars to keep their mouth shut. This entire tournament is riddled with fraud, corruption, oh, and cheating. I can recently I get two investigated the streamer known as Zept that was banned from the World Series of Wallzone. He was banned. Ah, ee, ooh, I'm strong. I'm independent. I'm dad's little princess. Men are always manipulating and they're wrong. Wrong. And for cheating. And I was able to uncover many examples that have started to surface on social media. The streamers are fuming. They have made up so many excuses. Zero. It's embarrassing. Zero. Even this idiot arranging Zero. a PC scan to clear his name. And of course they couldn't find anything. This is why Ricochet exists, because these people have no idea how cheat software works. Mm. The streamers complained for days on Twitter about this, yet refused to even speak about this. The walling is crazy, as he tracks the player to the door. Most people would be pre-aiming the door, anticipating an enemy. Well, not this guy. Everyone is cheating, as they lie, cheat, and scam their way to steal one million dollars. The person you are looking at is called Adrian. The team made of Aiden. These players took tens of thousands from Activision in last year's World Series. Mm -hmm. Then they absolutely flopped at the London Finals when they had to play in person. We can now make a reasonable claim to say Crazy. this person was walling from his bedroom. Like, if you guys remember the World Series of Warzone qualifiers, we got first in one of them and made like 10k each, and then the other one we got second in, and we got like seven. We like we made 17k each. In just those two qualifiers. And then in the LAN, we just didn't do that good. And then in, we, I don't know why, we just never cheated is the word you're looking for. Can I probably get like two pennies or something? A and guys, definitely check out this video on the screen because this like uh, was caught cheating as well. This is the last episode that we did. Yeah, man, check this one out. I swear to God, bro, like, it's just not stopping. What the hell is going on in online gaming? Check this video out, and I'll see you right there.